So time is running out for the Cowboy Breakfast. It ends in about 45 minutes. So you still have a chance to maybe head out there before you head to work and grab some yummy food, free food this morning. And that's why Mark Monstrola is over there with uh, some of his friends at the Long Center. Who have you got with us this time? I was telling uh, those guys in front of me here that I don't want to know what's going on behind me. I think we have the uh, the pig and the, the cow here hanging out and having a good time here today, along with a lot of families, the kids and the adults all having some fun here at the Long Center for Performing Arts. It goes until 9 a.m. We're at the Cowboy Breakfast, the uh, kickoff party for Rodeo Austin, which actually starts next weekend. It's a 15-day stretch they put together, the fair and the rodeo. It's going to be an awesome time, and we're going to talk to the president-elect about that here in just a moment. But uh, still plenty of breakfast left if you like to come and check it out. Beat the traffic, come on down here. Biscuits and gravy, we have the pancakes, uh, breakfast tacos, some sausage wraps, and some donuts too, and uh, some pralines as well if you like to get some sweets in and some coffee and hot chocolate to help keep you warm. So speaking of the president-elect, Brian Laney, why don't you come in here and join me? Uh, let's tell the folks at home, first off, how are you? I'm doing great this morning. How are you? Good to hear. I'm excellent. And uh, we're starting to stay warm here, but let's tell the folks at home now after the breakfast is over and we advance into the rodeo and the fair, what they can expect here in two weeks. Okay. Well, all of this is leading up to promoting Western heritage and youth education. We're all here to raise money for the kids. and. A week from this Saturday, the rodeo will start with Willie Nelson and uh, follow for two weeks of some good rodeo and entertainment. So this all started uh, back in the 30s with a stock show of uh, 16 animals. Correct. Now you guys are up to a world-class stock show. How, how do you think you grew so big and uh, what do you have planned uh, down the line coming up in the future? You know, it's all a bunch of great volunteers, good leadership. Uh, we hope we can double it again. You know, we're here to help kids and that's what it's all about. Speaking of helping the kids, how much have you guys put together this year to give away to the kids for the livestock show and the scholarships? You know, last year we gave two and a half million back to the youth of this great state, and, and we're hoping we can do 2.7. You know, we'll see. Hopefully the weather treats us right, and, and volunteers keep working hard. I'm sure you guys will be just fine. Uh, you put together a great show here today, and I'm sure the uh, rodeo and the fair will be just as good. Thanks a lot. You bet. Thank you. We appreciate, appreciate you being here. Absolutely. Thank you. All right, guys, let's send it back to the studio. Hey, Sally, so you know, just for you, Boys to Men is coming to the rodeo this year. I, mean, I can't know. Beat that. How Just awesome is that? On bended knee. How sweet yeah. of them. Exactly. <laughs> Mark, thank you for that amazing event out there. Appreciate it and appreciate your time. We'll be right back with more news, weather and traffic.